The feeling of breakthrough comes in many different flavors. The concept that most people have is that there's a single aha moment, a single sort of pivotal event that makes you realize that something is possible. But I would say, for me, it hasn't been crystallized into a single moment. It's often occurred over weeks or months when I finally get convinced by the facts, when I've gradually let myself believe that something might actually be possible. I'm Laura Nicholson. I'm a professor of anesthesiology and biomedical engineering at Yale, and I'm also the founder of Humicite. At Humicite, we are growing tissue-engineered blood vessels for patients who need them. We're essentially growing blood vessels from scratch. And what's beautiful about that platform is that we can use those concepts to grow tissues that can meet any one of a number of different medical needs. And so the goal of this technology is to be able to give you a new blood vessel off the shelf. Her drive has all very much been patient delivery based. She wanted to make a product that would help all of these patients in need, and she set out and she's done it. I would say that one of the things I'm most proud of was some of the time that I spent taking care of patients in the intensive care unit. And I will remember as long as I live taking care of an elderly woman who had terrible vascular disease, actually. And uh, I stayed up all night one night with this woman, and then the next day her daughter came in, and she said, thank you for saving my mother's life. And that sticks with you forever. And that's really another thing that I try to infuse into Humicite, is to really have us never forget that the blood vessels that we're making are going into patients who are trusting us to do a good job and to give them something that's really going to help them. That definitely inspired me to push yourself, you know, professionally, push yourself intellectually, to just keep keep doing the work and keep finding the answers and keep doing the research. You just keep going and keep going, all that stuff is gonna pay off in the end. But there is no, you know, there's no wasted effort. For me, the easiest and the most natural way of motivating people and leading them is showing them where the road goes as far as I can see it. By looking down the road and by explaining what I think is coming or what might happen as a consequence of our work, people understand the why and the so what and the who cares beyond themselves. And that makes people very excited and it makes them want to accomplish more and it makes them want to work with other people so that they can travel down the road even faster. I think that there are very few women who have been able to take that pathway from an, a vision and develop it into something that's a rising technology and it's going to eventually change the face of medicine.